Hello guys, my name is Ash Morant, and here we go, door number nine of the June Advent Canada. So let's have a look. Here we go, door number nine. Boom. Door number nine. What have we got? Looks like a fruity one. It is. Oh, boom. I've never tried this before. Oh, wow. I can't even pronounce that name, but it's a cherry bait wheel tart liqueur gin. Uh, 20% oh, alcohol volume. Cherry bait well tart. Uh, a delicious gin liqueur inspired by the traditional cherry bait well tart with notes of cherry al and almond. Best served over ice with your favourite mixer. Well, boom. Let's give this a go. Right, okay, here we go. Let's give it a go. Let's open it up here. Wow. Okay. Well, this is unreal. <clears throat> if you're from the UK and you like a Mr. Kipling cherry bait well tart, smells like a Mr. Kipling cherry bait well tart. Oh, mate, that smells nice. Oh, right. Two ice cubes in a gin glass. No bitter aftertaste, nothing. Oh, that's nice. Very, it's sweet. You can definitely taste the cherry. Oh, mate, I might have to buy a big bottle of that. Right, Fever Tree Tonic Water. I did say any flavoured of your choice. I don't know what garnish to put with it, I'm not gonna lie. Wow, 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 wow. Well, it's 100% true. You can taste the almond, you can taste the cherry. It is like a cherry bait well tart. Um, number two, there is a hint of bitter, only because of the, the tonic, but it's a five out of five. If you add it with lemonade, you'll, you'll have no aftertaste, no bitter down the back. It is so smooth, it's unreal. That's one of the most nicest gins I've ever tasted. And I'm shocked. I'm not really like a flavoured gin. But that has got me going, mate. This is probably one of the nicest gins I've ta flavoured gins I've tasted. Doesn't matter if it's, what is it, 20%, 20% alcohol volume. It's so nice. The cherry and almond you can taste through. It does t smell like a cherry bait will tart. It's nice and light. It's smooth. I like, I like it with tonic because I like the bitter, like that, the hint of aftertaste. But if you like the same ginger ale or whatever, it will go great with any mixer. Lemonade, you'll have no problem. You'll have the sweet taste, but there's no like aftertaste like the bitterness. This is one of the nicest gins I've ever tasted. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Well, that is door number nine on a Friday. Leave your comments, guys. Tell me what you think. Find this bottle, I highly recommend because I'm buying one. That is brilliant, honestly. Guys, thanks for watching Door 9, and I'll see you tomorrow for Door 10. Thanks for watching, I'll see you soon.